What's going on guys and welcome to a new playthrough. Uh, this isn't going to replace Majora's Mask, this will just be a side playthrough. This is uh, Pokemon Yellow. Now that intro you just saw was a little weird, like in my opinion. Like, um, personally I prefer the red and blue intro, but that's just personal preference. But like, um, I kind of wanted to LP it to play through a Pokemon game, but at the same time, like, um, I don't, I feel like Gen 1, like, um, when it comes to Pokemon Yellow, I don't really feel this game gets talked about as much in hindsight as, say, Red and Blue do, and there are, are quite a bit of differences. I'll point each one of them out, and we're gonna just get started. Now, I should point out one thing. I'm gonna set my mystery to fast, but, uh, I'm actually not playing this on console. I'm playing this on an emulator. I emulated this on my Wii, so, uh, yeah, I wish that continue was test to see how the save game, see if the save works, but uh, let's start a new game. Hello there, welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak, people call me the Pokemon Prof, Professor. This world is inhabited by creatures called Pokemon. For some people, Pokemon are pets, others use them for fights. Myself, I study Pokemon as a profession. What is your name again? Well, it's named after the channel name. Well, the honest bear is not going to fit, so let's just call it Bear. Good, so your name is Bear. This is my grandson. He's been your rival since you were a baby. Aaron, what was his name again? Let's just name it after the anime. That's right, I remember now. His name is Gary. Bear. Your, Pokemon, your own Pokemon Legends of Ultimate Fold. A world of dreams and adventures with Pokemon Ways. Let's go. Now, once Pokemon Yellow is that they take a lot of elements from the anime. I'll try to point out as many as possible. We're playing the SNES. Okay, it's time to go. Anyway, so, uh, one thing I would personally recommend doing first off, right off the bat, is withdrawing this poster from the PC. Now, there's going to be another distinct advantage I have to playing this on an emulator over a console. You see this little fast forward? I can basically speed up the grinding process. So yeah. Let's, try, let's actually see what our mother has to say. So uh... Right, all boys sleep home today. You said so on TV. Professor Organizer is looking for you. And what she said. I'm raising Pokemon too. When they get strong, they can protect me. If we go next door... Hi, Bear. Gary is out at Grandpa's lab. So yeah, it basically gives us the second hint on what to do. However, if we go there... Yo, Bear. Gramps isn't around. I ran here because he said he had a Pokemon for me. If we look, it says, uh, that's a Pokeball. There's a Pokemon inside. Anyway, so I guess there's not much left to do, so I guess we can go upwards. Hey, wait, don't go out! That was close. Wild Pokemon live in tall grass. This Pikachu appeared in level 5. This is actually the only way you're gonna find Pikachu in the whole game, and Professor Oak's Pokeball is a guaranteed catch. Alright, Pikachu was caught. Phew. Pokemon can appear any time in tall grass. You need your very own Pokemon for your protection. I know. I can come with me. This cutscene does not play in red and blue. It just goes instantly to the lab. Friends, I'm fed up with waiting. Hmm, Gary, what are you here already? I said for you to come by later. Or whatever, just wait there. Look there. Do you see that ball on the table? Call the Pokeball, hold the Pokemon side. You may have it, go and take it. Hey, Grant, what about me? Be patient, Gary. You can, I'll give you one later. If we take it, though. 
No way, Bear. I want this Pokemon. Gary snaps the Pokemon. Gary, what are you doing? Gramps, I want this one. But I... Oh, alright then. That Pokemon is yours. I was going to give you one anyway. Bear, come over here. Bear, this is the Pokemon I caught earlier. You can have it. I caught it in the wild and it's not tame yet. And we received the Pikachu, which we were going to give a nickname. Because, uh... I thought of a very fitting nickname for this Pikachu, and not only that, like, it's very fitting because this game puts a lot of elements from the anime. I thought of, uh, since they're no, they're, they're no longer using Ash's character, I thought this would be a fitting nickname for the Pikachu. And wait, Bear, it's still got a Pokemon. Come on, take you on. Now, you don't have to win this battle, but if you lose this battle or win it, it determines the outcome of, uh... Because he's... Because he's had sound on Eevee. Regar if you win or lose this battle, it's actually going to determine what he evolves his Eevee into. Like, he, he's already used... He's going straight for the tail whip. He's, gonna, he's probably going to spam tail whip and just, like, uh... Try to tackle us to death. He's really having the same type of attack on us. He's not really doing that much damage. Or, yeah, I think one more Thundershock should take it out. Actually, no! Wow, he almost lost this battle. And we were level 6! And we learned Tail Whip. It's a move Pikachu does not learn in Red and Blue. Yeah, I'll make my Pokemon fight to toughen it up. Bear Gramps, tell you later. What? Would you look at that? It's odd, but it appears that your Pokemon Pikachu just likes Pokeballs. So you just keep it with you. That should make you happy. You can talk to it and see how it feels about you. Can we do that? Yeah, he doesn't like us very much. That's basically another thing they took from the anime. Is that, uh, initially in the anime, Ash's Pikachu does not really like him that much. Anyway, so this is Route 1, anyway, so if we talk to this guy right here... Hi, I work in Pokemon Mart. It's a convenience shop, so please visit us in Viridian City. I know, I'll give you a sample. Here you go. And we got Potion. Anyway, so there are two new Pokemon you can find here. There's Pidgey, which is a very bulky flying type. Personally, I feel there are other better flying types you can find in this game, and I'll get to them later. And there's a peak, and, there, and the other is Ranida, which is a normal type, not not very good poke normal type. There are just so many better options, even if Ranida learns some pretty good moves. Anyway, so if we, uh, so we're going to go to the, uh, we're going to go to the, uh, Mart. Hey, you came from Pallet Town. You know Professor Oak, right? His order came, we're going to take it to, um, it's Oak's Parcel. And so we have to go back to Pallet Town. Now, the way back to Pallet Town is actually quicker than it is to get to Pallet Town. So we can just go jump down the groups. We just jump down these uh, ledges. Now that we're back at Pallet Town, we're basically uh, going to deliver our spar cell back. Hey Bear, how's my old Pokemon? Well, it seems to like you a lot. You must be telling me you're a Pokemon trainer. I just got this Pokemon like five minutes ago. What? You have something for me? Bear delivered Oak's Power Cell. Oh, this is a custom Pokeball I ordered. Thanks, Bear. By the way, I must ask you to do something for me. Gramps. Gramps, my Pokemon is going strong and check it out. Ah, oh, Gary, good timing. I need to ask you both of you to do something for me. On the desk, there's my invention, Pokedex. It automatically records data on Pokemon you've seen or caught. It's a high-tech encyclopedia. 
Bear and Gary, take these with you. And we got the Pokedex from Oak. To make a complete value of po all the Pokemon in the world, that was my dream. But I'm too old, I can't do it. So I want you two to fulfill my dream for me. Get moving, you two. This is a great undertaking in Pokemon history. Alright, Gramps, leave it all to me. Bear, I hate to say it, but I don't need you. I know, I have a lot of time after I said so I'm gonna not to win you one, Bear. Ha ha ha! Interestingly enough, we can actually, um, lent, we can actually get the, uh, we can actually get the, uh, town map anyway if we go. We don't really need it. Grandpa actually run an errand here. I hope this will help you. We got the town map. You don't really need it for playthroughs. I'm mainly, I'm mainly showing it for educational purposes, and, uh, I'm gonna lead off this part of Pokemon Red, so, Pokemon, not Pokemon Red, Pokemon Yellow. So, uh, next time Pokemon Yellow, we will go back to Viridian City, so I'll see you guys next time.